Hey everybody, hello, how are you doing? Merry Christmas. Uh, that's the best I could do for right now. I still have to try to find my neon Christmas tree. I've looked, look, I'm, I've been working on so many different projects that I don't know where my neon Christmas tree is. Next year, I'm not going to buy things way in advance and stash them somewhere and then forget where I put them. Okay, hello, how was your day? Mine was, you know, fine. It was a day we got our electricity fixed. So yay, we have that tomorrow. We're getting the heat turned on or fixed. Hopefully the guy can fix our heater so we'll have heat in this house and yay. I mean, then we'll all be flat broke, but it will we'll have heat and electricity and you don't know how much you take those things for granted until you don't have them. I've got Timu bag here and then I've got another one behind me that is I believe what I I took a peek because I was like what in the world is this big box and it looks like some things that were not included in my first pretty in pink haul so which was Timu sponsored so we might get to this bag we might not let me see what's in this thing first okay let's start this haul what is my face doing okay it's just doing what it does the first thing in here is something I almost cut up oh it feels like a sponge the first thing in here is a sponge oh just kidding it's a sweatshirt I accidentally cut it open with my scissors, not the sweatshirt, but it's bag when I was cutting open this bag. Well, when they, oh, wait a minute. Oh, I forgot to tell you. Well, the bag is, are you guys, are you kidding me? <laughs> Stop it. The bag was taped to the, this bag. You guys remember? If you caught my, if you're new to my channel, hi, thank you for being new to my channel. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you for coming back. And if you caught, was it yesterday? It all blends into one long day. If, it, if you caught my last haul when I shook the bag and twirled it around, well, something of course fell out and I missed it and I forgot. And it was this avocado necklace, which I think is the coolest thing I've ever seen on Timu, it's an avocado. And so it made me laugh, so I bought it. And then it made me laugh even more, so I wore it. And the rest of this is not, these earrings are from Mimi's Life. I won them in one of her giveaways. This sweater is the sweater that if you caught this story, this lady at work was just like, hey, do you want a sweater? It's too small for me in the arms or whatever. And then she just dropped it on my desk and walked off. So I wore it today. It will probably be the only time I wear it. I don't know. Then it will probably go in the donation bag. It's a little weird in the sleeves and the shoulders. I mean, I don't know what it... Maybe I have it on backwards. It's got no tags in it anywhere. But she got it from Amazon. And then I'm wearing pants, of course. I'm not sitting here with no pants on. Okay, so the first thing in here is... Oh, I forgot the garbage bag. Darn it. Just keep them by the bed. And I'm also really bummed because... I don't know when you'll see this because we can't... We have no internet now. I don't know what's going on with the router. I'm going to go down after this video and try resetting it. But poor Alexa can't connect to the router, so I just get the generic female, um, I'm sorry, I can't understand that. The internet is not connected like that, and I, I feel like it, it's sorry, hard. Sorry, I didn't get that. The internet isn't reachable. Like that, she says that. I feel like I'm having relationship problems with a boyfriend. I feel sad, because you guys know... I got the manly voice on mine. He's my boyfriend. Sometimes he's the only man I talk to on a daily basis. And when he's not talking to me, I I feel like we're having relationship problems. Like we're going through some kind of a breakup. 
get to the point this sweatshirt says peace love and coffee it is spongy on the outside but it is fleece on the inside so why why can't it be both like why can't it be good sweatshirt material oh i hate the way it feels so much i don't know we'll see how it feels after i wash it and then i'm done i'm almost done with the catastrophe that is my mother's room where i thought it would be cool to con mari method all my clothes and then it just turned into a big nightmare and a never-ending nightmare well i finally got everything con would in there and now i just have to put things away everything's in perfect piles of where they need to go and then i'm devoting an hour every day to getting rid of junk so even if like the, yesterday i got up at five in the morning and worked from 5 30 to 6 30 in the morning and then i jumped in the shower and then i got ready for no not yesterday i took yesterday off monday and then i got ready for work what is this okay this is something it's a pillow because we don't have enough pillows in in our lives after this video if, if i can get the internet to work because I, I need to upload things. I'm going to unbox an air fryer. I hope you'll check that out. No, we're not going to be air frying stuff on my bed. But yes, I have to unbox it. Because that company is so mad at me right now. They're like, you've had our air fryer for months. Oops, I think I have. Okay, this is a... a I thought this pillow looked cool. So you guys know me, I just, I have a thing. I'm always buying pillows. I'm, I like to hoard pillows. Let's see if I can even get it open though. I still don't have any fingernails on. So many fingernails, so little motivation to suddenly put them on, not put them on. Okay, oh, I got one thing. See, if I had fingernails, they would be gone right there. Now I got to get this one open. Come on. Um, I don't know. Let's just rip the box. Forget the handle. Why do I care about the handle? Just pull this part open. Okay, we got part of it open. We got part of it open. Get this part open. Do I have to cut it with my gigantic... Okay, wait. Here's something. It's doing something. All right, I did it, I did it. Okay, it's, what in the world is this? It says, is it for a child? Hold on a minute. I can't breathe. All right, here's a picture. It's all in Chinese. TPE pillow. And it looks like it's about as big as like an airplane pillow, like the kind they give you on airplanes. If you've never been on an airplane, it's small. Ooh, it feels all watery. What's inside of it? It's squishy. It's like a water bed. <laughs> Anybody remember the 70s water beds? Ew. How do we get this off? Can we take this off and look inside it? Should we cut it open? Here, this is a pillowcase. Let's look at this thing. Ew, it feels like one of those toy snakes that you have to try to pick up and you can't. Oh my gosh. This is what it is. Wow, I don't even know, you guys. Here, should we pose for a thumbnail? What is it? <laughs> what is it? I don't I never know how to make thumbnails where people are like, <gasps> but she's she's what in the world? Anyway, 
I don't know. It feels disgusting. Oh, it feels sticky and gross. It's really kind of um, in, uh, in a sensory, on a sensory level. It's kind of satisfying to squish this thing around. It's really sticky though. I don't understand it. I don't understand it. I guess it's supposed to be good for your neck. I already have my awesome pillow that I love uh, that is good for my neck. So I don't know why I thought I would buy another one. I just, I didn't know it was going to be this small for one thing. And then what does it feel like when you lay down on it? Hold on a minute. I don't know. It feels like I'm lying down on... Don't mind me. It feels like I'm lying down on something squishy. I'm going to put it behind my back. You know, we can always just take pillows and put them behind our back. That's the one thing about... Okay. Cool. Now I can take the bear and put him somewhere respectable. Like on that pile. Okay, so I don't know. You guys, TPE, high elastic material... It really stinks in here. I don't know why this cat always decides to poop in her litter box right before I start making a video. And then I'm almost dead from the smell. Okay, let's see how much that cost. Oh, yeah. The last thing I was watching was agenda-free TV on YouTube. I was watching that school shooting today that's that was horrible um no timu i don't want to play this sweater is really bothering me i should have changed clothes see it fits stripe maybe i have it on backwards but it fits in a weird way i probably do have it on backward okay i don't know my orders delivered okay where's the pillow right here this looks like the well there's peace love and coffee sweatshirt which was in case you care peace love and coffee 944 and it is now 1047 okay so there's that i just have to find my squishy pillow whatever it was i would say don't don't get it there it is, squishy pillow. I also have a Timu order out in my mailbox. It's, it's uh, I'm not gonna ask what the temperature is, but I think it's like 32 degrees. It's freezing out there. I'm just gonna get it tonight when I take the dog out down there. And okay, washable pillow, get one piece washable pillow gift for the elders me i guess that's me i'm the elder massage pressure free pillow tpe pectin health pillow core 29.98 it is so small ew innovative high elastic material artificial skin known as TPE material, comfortable to the touch, rebound, stretch, deformation. Okay, I don't know. Five times stretch without deformation. 0.16 seconds instant rebound. Well, that doesn't matter. I don't want to stretch it. I want to sleep on it. Release cervical pressure to help fast sleep. Okay, well, I don't know. It's supposed to be good for your neck, but it just feels like I'm on something squishy right now. $29.98 is what it costs right now. I paid $26.99 for it. That's exciting. Okay, the next thing in here is a little, I think this is a little furry purse that is a knockoff of Mew Mew. Is that how you say it? Mew, 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 mew. M I U, M I U. It's a lot smaller than I thought it would be. And, well, it flat out says, oh, it says Min Min. <laughs> 
Those silly people with their knockoff purses. No one will know if I walk really fast. It looks like it says... Does it have a little strap? Yeah, please tell me. It's got D-rings, so it's, surely it has a strap. It has got a strap in it, and then the inside has got a zippered pocket, and it's got... Does it have slip pockets? No, it does not. It just has a zippered inner pocket, and then it's a little furry. I don't know why they felt the need to cover up this plastic handle with a with plastic and this too. But you can. What this is cool. You can connect these two together and snap them. I don't. I mean, why? Why? Though, would you want to? It looks nifty, I guess. I guess if you just want to be ultra secure. And it feels very, you know, soft and fluffy. Like I skinned a stuffed animal to, to make it. Okay, I didn't really need that. Well, do I need any of this stuff? No. Okay, let's find it. Let's see what I paid for that. Or if not, we won't. I don't see it. I don't see it. Is it in peace, love, and coffee order? No. Okay, forget it. Forget it. We're not doing this again tonight. I can't help it if Timu put 19... There it is. Timu put 19 orders in one bag. Fourteen forty nine. Holy cow. And then this item was discontinued. And I did get some kind of a price adjustment on it. But, okay, well, I mean, it's a cute little white bag for it. It'll go with my Santa Claus outfit, actually. My Santa Claus dress. Okay, the next thing, I can't stop buying slippers. I can't stop buying slippers. Cheese. Nobody wants to see. This is not an exciting thumbnail. No one of those dudes are always emailing me going, We can help make your thumbnails more exciting. People are always hitting me up for, like, offering to optimize my search, optimize my channel, search engine, optimize, make my channel more SEO, whatever. These look smallish. They're 40, 41. I wear a size 8. I don't know. They look very small, and they look cuter in the picture, but these are cute little slippers cheese okay wait all right slippers i paid 9.99 for them and oh my mom loved her slippers i gave them to her this morning i was gonna wait till christmas but it was so cold down there I felt bad for her feet, and I said, see if these work, because they, they had a little back to them. She loved them. Yay! Okay, now these are $8.39, and yeah, you can get the highest size they come in is 7.5 to 8, which is what I got, but it looks more 7 to me. I don't know, and it says peach, but they look pink. Maybe I'm just colorblind. I mean, sometimes I really am. That's no joke. Okay, throw them over there with my other slippers. Oh, I made it perfect. They landed perfectly next to my other slippers. It was a good throw. I would have gotten that throw on camera. All right, the next thing in this Timu bag is this. Oh, what am I going to do with this? I accidentally bought this. Now, we love this shirt, and I accidentally bought it twice. And this one is in an XL. I don't, I don't know. Put it in a giveaway box. 
Okay, the next thing in here is, but anyway, that shirt is $14.99 and it is now, I paid $14.99. It's now $13.49 and it goes up to XXL. And then this is free. These were free. Like you got a free gift with order and it's a, hold on, I'm going to take it out. Well, I'm going to put this down in the kitchen and try to make my mom laugh. Put it down where she can see it. Like, it's really. <laughs> it says, I poop breakfast. What's your superpower? It's a chicken. <laughs> That's disgusting and hilarious at the same time. Yuck. What's your superpower? Okay. And then the next thing, this was free also. And it's a lady with a black cat. That I'm for Loki has a really funny looking little head. Like it looks more like Felix, my old my late cat Felix. And she lived happily ever after with her wine and her cat. I like that. That's awesome. What am I going to do with all these tin signs? Probably ultimately throw them away someday in frustration. Okay, I bought more clothes. No. Please, no. Did I buy this twice? Come on. No, I didn't. Here's the token weird piece of no, tissue paper. Okay, I bought... No, this is slightly different than the other one I bought. I bought a little lace shirt that will look cute in the spring. Which is a long way away, but that's all right. And do I have that right in front of my face or do I have to search all over the place for it? I gave my coworker her snoop on a stoop today and she really loved it. Okay, my little white shirt is right. Is that it? Mm -hmm. That's not it. It's another little white shirt. There it is. That little white shirt is really cute. And I got it in a large. I paid $6.74 for it. It is thirteen forty eight, and it looks good on the model. Living her best life on the beach or wherever she is. All right, I can't wait. Can't wait to live my best life in that shirt. This is a crumpled up card that says thou shall not let low vibing sketchy ass energy penetrate thy aura okay that's nice i don't know it's funny kind of uh, but what am i going to do with it it's a piece it's not tin it's not canvas it's just a big piece of cardboard and they bent it up here and I'll put that next to the sign that says your anxiety is lying to you and I don't know what I paid for that you guys I hope I didn't pay a lot for it because I mean you know oh I know where it is it's way up here I know where it is it's right there Okay, my nutcracker is still out for delivery. I paid two twenty one for that. It's now two forty eight. It says Buddha statue wall art, spiritual and encouragement gifts for women. All right, if you say so. And what is this? Oh, it's another one of those toilet back stickers. You put this on the back of your. Toilet, you put this on your toilet tank.
to make your bathroom festive. Of course, it's all wrinkled up. I'm not complaining, but I mean, I'm kind of complaining. It's all wrinkled up. We'll, we'll give it a shot. I'll flatten it out overnight. I don't know how much that cost. I don't, it costs probably a dollar something. And I've bought it already once. But fortunately, we have a lot of toilets in this house. So there it is. I'm, I'm just in case you two want a toilet tank sticker, you could probably still get it before Christmas if you order fast. It is 27 cents. Well, it's I paid 27 cents and it's now 98 cents. And it's funny. I mean, when you put it on, it ends up looking like this. Okay. I'm sorry I can't just point to a picture right here on my screen. I mean, I could do that. It would take me all night long, though, to edit it. And I just don't have a lot of time. I like to just one and done. Okay, I bought this purple cat, you guys. We already have the orange one. And I like the purple one, too, so I bought her. Now I've got the orange one and the purple one. They can sit by side by side in the Halloween storage box for now because I don't want a lot of stuff out. And she is still available. I paid $8.99 for her, and she's now $9.98. Okay. And then... This is another version of that birthday card that I liked. Happy 29th birthday from your 110 pound friend. It makes me laugh all the time. I don't know why, it's just the little things amuse me. So I bought an extra one, oops. And now I just ruined it. No, no I didn't. Okay. Birthday cards, I saw a lot of them here. Lean back on this squishy thing. I paid $2.98 for that, and it's still $2.98. And then I bought it again. How many times did I buy this card? I mean, it's it's funny, but it's not that funny. Here's this one. I feel like this is deja vu, too. We've hauled it one other time, right? Have I bought this card three times? My voice is getting all screechy. This one is has a cute cartoon lady from the 50s and well my boss's birthday is coming up my mom's birthday is coming up like everybody is going to get this birthday card for me happy birthday 29 from your 110 pound friend this one is nice it's 298 it comes with seals to seal the envelope envelope however you prefer to pronounce it closed and yeah for my mom I mean I'd have to cross out friend and write daughter now I think I've got three of those all right and that thing is in my mailbox and this is a sign that says I bought it for our, we have a bar downstairs. A wet bar, I think they call it. Alcohol, because no great story ever started with someone eating a salad. <laughs> All the funny signs were just getting to me that day. You know how Timu is, once I bought one funny sign, like... I poop breakfast, what's your superpower? Then Timu just started showing me all the signs ever. And like a sucker, I was just like, yeah, that's going to look cute in our bar. 
because no great story ever started with someone eating a salad. I'm sure there's someone out there who has a great story that started with eating a salad. I was eating a salad and suddenly I looked up and George Clooney was at the table next to me. My mom hit George Clooney in our rental car um, when we... <laughs> so this was back in the old days when George Clooney was on... There was a show called The Facts of Life. And in the later seasons, George Clooney was on that show. He played George. I think his name was George. And he was just a young kid with curly black hair. And he like worked in their store or something. And I went to my mom and I, my mom flew out with me. We went to visit Pepperdine because they were offering me a scholarship and Pepperdine University out in Malibu. And they were offering me a scholarship. And so we flew out there to look at it and take a tour and all of that. And then we decided to go to Beverly Hills and just look around and pretend that we belong there. And then we got really lost. And those are the old days where you had just maps. Like you had to drive around with like big maps unfolded. And I had the map unfolded. And she was, we were down this side street. And then we were, um, she, she looked over to look at my map. And all of a sudden I looked up and I went, mom, stop. And she hit the brake really fast. It, right when this guy put his hands down on the hood of our car. He was crossing the street and she stopped and he was like on the hood of our car. Like she didn't hit him almost though. And I looked up and I went, oh, that's George from the facts of life. And then I waved at him and he waved back and like, you know, just laughed and stuff. And I was like, oh my gosh, wigging out. And now we look back and we're like, Mom almost killed George Clooney. Could you imagine the timeline that would have interrupted of like Hollywood or, yeah, history? If my mom would have hit George Clooney, that was anyway, we, yeah, he bounced off the hood of our car, kind of like, you know, just like caught it and like, just kind of went wham like this. And, but he was nice about it. He's the nicest guy I've ever hit with a car in my life. Like, he was just so nice. You know who else is really nice? Ally Sheedy, if you remember that actress, because I used to wait tables then while I was out there in college, and I used to wait tables at this restaurant called The Real Inn on the beach, and I got fired because I kept screwing up everybody's... I was a horrible waitress, and Ally Sheedy came in, and not only did I totally screw up her order, but then I dumped it all over her lap, and... I felt so bad about it and I was almost crying and my boss was just horrified and it was a big thing and she still left me a hundred dollar tip. That was nice of her. Okay, alcohol, that wooden sign was free. I went to all that, but it's $2.48. And then this one says, what was the matter? There was something wrong with me this day. I don't know, where am I gonna put all these signs? As for me and my house, we will serve tacos, salsa, 24-7. It's a play off of, as for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. Is that how, did I get that right? Although, and I can't quote the chapter and verse. As for me and my house, we will serve tacos. I don't know, I'm going to stick that in the kitchen one day too. I wish, I, now I really want a taco. We have a pizza downstairs, but they put like too much. I don't know. The sausage on the pizza is so spicy. It's almost inedible. And we were both like, whoa, what is going on with this spicy spice? I go, mom, did you order spicy sausage? She's like, no, I didn't order spicy sausage. Okay, forget it. I can't get that back in there. I don't know how much that taco sign was. Okay, um, the next thing in here are these two little earrings that are like Gucci dupes. Or they would have you believe they've got G's on them. Let me get them out of here. 
As for me and my house, we will serve tacos. I was, hung I was hungry and easily amused that day that I ordered that. Not drinking. Somebody asked in my comments, are you drinking when you order these things? <laughs> no. Okay, G's little... Can you see the G? Kinda. My hands are shaking. I don't know why I just ate pizza. Well, what I could before my mouth just caught on fire and I couldn't take it anymore. Okay, what were those? How much did those cost? Does anybody care? I mean, somebody might want to buy them. I don't know. There's my avocado necklace. I love that avocado necklace. All right, I don't know. I wish I could tell you. There they are. There they are. They are $1.43 chic rhinestone mini letter G round plate drop dangle earrings. And they're still, no, they're $1.43. Okay. Beautiful. Okay, the next thing in here is a little bracelet, and I don't, I'm like, I'm not a big bracelet wearer, unless it's from Gona Jewelry. Oh, I have to do that video too, but they want to see it first before I publish it, and they're not paying me. I don't like, I don't, if you're going to pay, if you're paying me, then yes, you can see the video before I publish it. But if you're not paying me, I don't know, you guys. That's a bad attitude. I love this bracelet. It's beautiful. It's really beautiful, especially when I get it turned all turned around the right way. And then it fastens here, and it's got this little clasp that has the tree up. And it slithers like a snake when you drop it. It's got the tree of life on it. Really pretty. I love it. That, I'm glad I bought it. No regrets. And where are my glasses? I still need to buy one of those glasses chains. They're everywhere. Why can't I just grab one at Walgreens or something? What's the matter with me? What's the matter with me? All right. I want to know what that cost. I want to know what that costs. I want you to tell me. There it is. Okay. That cost free. It was zero, zero, zero. But if you buy it for real, it's $3.14. And you can get it in this color, which is called Picture Shows. Or you can get it in, wait a minute, picture shows two. Oh, you, little squares, or you can get it in long rectangles. I didn't have that choice when I picked it out for free. It was one of those, like, buy five things, get three things free, or buy three things, get five things free, or one of those things, you guys. Okay, the next thing in here is a shirt. No. All right, let's feel it. Okay, it's soft. It's a Christmas t-shirt. Perfect. Why? I don't... It's from a boutique, so they folded it with tissue paper. That was thoughtful of them. And it's just a retro deer. And it says, oh, dear, Christmas is here. It's cute. And, yeah, it feels like it just got ironed on. But it's cute. Now I've got a Christmas t-shirt for every day of the rest of the month. And I'm going to wear that on casual day with a long sleeve shirt under it. Like one of those long sleeve white, like waffle knit shirts under it or something like all the kids do oh 
dear, Christmas is here. That costs $6.99, and it's still $6.99. What did I get it in? I got it in double XL, okay. Because I like big shirts, and I cannot lie. All right, I think the last thing in here, there might be two things in here. I got an LED bulb. That is, look at the box, you guys. Is the bulb even in one piece in here? Probably. Okay. Another one of these? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know why I thought I needed that, but uh, okay. Sure. I have no idea what I paid for that, and I don't think any of us care. And I think this is the last thing. It's a jewelry box. Okay, it's a little box. It says, best wishes. <gasps> is it moissanite? Is it, a oh my gosh, I bought some moissanite. Woo! Did I get two carrots? Right on! These are nifty. What did I pay for these? Wow, my fingers are bad. Maybe I'll put on nails before I go to sleep. I can't ask Alexa what time it is. Because she doesn't like... Wow! Here. Those are Ugh. If the closer I get to them, then the worse my fingernails get. So those are fantastic. Woo! Look at them sparkle. I can't. All right. There's their warranty ID from the GRA. Next, I'm going to buy one of those. Can you buy one of those little guns here that I can shoot jewelry with and see if it's Real oh that camping lantern which is what this is was two forty four. I guess I'm going camping. I don't I have no idea. I don't know. The avocado necklace that I'm wearing, golden avocado, steel shell avocado. Two ninety eight. What is that sound? I don't know. It's not a horse. All right, avocado necklace is two ninety eight, but I'm looking for the moissanite, please. Looking for love in all the wrong places. There they are. There they are. Fifteen dollars and thirty eight cents is what I paid for them, and they are now twenty dollars and ninety eight cents. $25.98. Wait, did I get two carrots? I got two carrots each. And I paid $15.38. I must have had a discount code. Cool. Alright, I think that's all that's in this bag. But this time I'll be very careful when I dump it upside down and twirl it around. Okay. Check the corners. Check the inside corners. Okay. There goes that. Uh, the thing I liked the most were the moissanite earrings, probably. And I poop breakfast. What's your superpower? No, I'm just kidding. And I love that Oh Dear t-shirt. Okay, we're... My gosh, it is heavy. We're opening this now because it actually only has like three things in it, I think. Everything. So if you caught my pretty in pink Timu haul, that was a Timu sponsored haul, meaning they gave me those items in exchange for the video. And not everything was in that 
thing. And one of the things, this is heavy though, shoot. I got this for my niece. But it's going to be a, you know what, to ship this thing. It is a claw machine. Oh, it's not that heavy once I get it out. Okay, it's a claw machine. And it comes with, I hope, the little stuffed animals in it. And you charge it. I hope my brother can figure this out because <laughs> all the instructions are in. I don't know if that's Japanese, Chinese. I have no idea. Chinese, but claw machine. I wish I could open it and show it to you, but well, yeah, can we do it? And then I'll just tape it back closed. What if it's in styrofoam, though? I guess we won't know until we look. These big scissors. Okay. Wow. All right, I'm not gonna take it all out, but I mean, what the first thing I see are little balls. Oops, well, little toys. There's the be bear's head. It's all wrapped up securely in there. And there's the USB charger, so I guess you, and you can move the little claw and get the little toys out with it. It's good. That'll also help with like her motor skills. Or maybe not. I don't know. Maybe my brother's going to punch me in the face and say, why? Why did you do this to us? Okay, sorry about the crinkling. Okay, then I will just tape that back up and tell him I was doing a quality check on it but that is cute for a little kid so let me get back to my influencer program page and I can put the description I mean the description the links to all of these oh no I forgot something hold on a minute Now I'm stuck on that Bob the Builder. Can we fix it, Bob the Builder? Yes, we can. Um. Okay. One moment. Okay, what... Get out. Get me out of here. What is happening here? Okay, influencer program. Sorry, gosh, that was weird. Effective December 5th, referrals can now receive a 30% off discount instead of 50. Okay, where's me? Here's me. Here are my campaigns. Here are my, what am I, level six? Oh, I have a seating balance of $91.92. Right on. Okay, anyway, let us... That's where I want to go. Okay, gosh. Bring home the fun mini claw machine clip doll. Perfect for kids. $44.99. Thanks, Timu. Now what else is in here is it looks like either the tool kit or the power drill. I kind of hope it's the tool kit because I really need that more than I need a power drill. And the rest of my stuff still did not show up. Oh well. 
Maybe they refunded it, and that's why I have so much seating. That's why I have that seating balance money. This is, yay, the tool kit. It's a pink tool kit. Cute. I think this is the tool kit, and then you open it and you slide this up. Please don't let stuff get sprung all over my bed. Oh, and then you, okay. Wow. Everything in it is pink. Look at these cute, yay, we have some new scissors for the scissor family. Where do these go, right here? Okay, we got these things, I don't know what those are. <laughs> I don't know what any of this stuff is. It looks like a wrench, and some needle nose, some pliers, some screwdrivers, some screwdriver heads. And then on this side, you have a pink hammer. Oh, pink hammer, pink scissors, which you already saw and loved. Okay, annoying. Pink hammer, pink, is it measuring tape? That's a leveler, I think, and nails. All right, cool. Wait, something fell. Oh, the scissor. I'm like, something's missing. It's the scissors. That's really cute. It's like a Barbie. It's like a little Barbie thing. But it's for grown-ups. It's heavy, you guys. Okay, let me close it all up. I feel so important now that I have tools. How do you close it up? <laughs> Oh, you go like this. That's pretty cool. You kind of like have to go out like it's, yeah. All right. And then, oh, you know what's weird about this though? It doesn't have a handle to carry it. You just have to carry it like this. That's kind of strange. That's my only kind of, hi, I'd like a handle please. So I can carry my tool kit instead of carrying it under my shoulder, like a, under my arm, like a football or something. But that was $51.99 for, not for me, I didn't pay for it. And so I still have not gotten my power drill, my pink power drill, and my floral arrangements, and my angel numbers painting. I don't think I'm going to get those. I'm happy that I got the claw machine that I wanted to give my niece for Christmas, so... That's cool. All right, it's 52.52. 52 minutes and 52 seconds. That's okay. Should we open some advent calendars? What are the, where are the cats? Get the stack of them. I think I can reach it without falling. Listen for the crash. All right, let's open. I'm opening. If you want to leave, I understand. If not, I'm going to open some advent calendars. The first thing I'm going to open is the one from Pop Feel with makeup in it. And what a mess, though. Look at all this stuff everywhere. Get out of here. How am I going to get out? I'm trapped. I'm surrounded by a sea of junk. Okay, what is the date today? Oh, shoot. I don't know. Wednesday, December 6th, and I skipped the 5th, right? We didn't do it last night. So here's the 5th for Pop Feel. Wow, my lips are dry. Woo, speaking of pink, I wonder if that's eyeshadow or what that is. That is really pink. Really pink eyeshadow, blush, whatever you want it to be, I guess. Blush. Okay, it's cute. All right, there, that's day five, and then day six.
is right here. I wish I had some water. Why did I think this is oh, okay? All right, day six. Is another one. It looks like another blush. It's so small. Well, or I'd actually prefer to use this as eyeshadow, please. I think this is eyeshadow. Maybe they're both eyeshadows. That's pretty, though. That's really pretty. Cool. All right. Thanks, Pop Feel. See you tomorrow. I love Advent calendars. We've had advent calendars ever since I was a little kid, except we had them with chocolate in them. Okay, there's the advent cal. Let's get the weird skincare one. Eel Ho. Let's get Eel Ho. Eel Ho, day number five. Ew. Is. Oho, Saggy Reduce Anti-Cellulite Cream. I thought we just got some of that. I have no idea, but sure, I'll believe that when I see it. What does it have in it? Wormwood, Frankincense, Scalaria Root Extract, Angelica ex Extract, and Collagen, finally. Collagen is the last item in the ingredient list. Okay, well, sure, I'll rub that all over my butt, see if it helps. Okay, next is day six. <gasps> oh no, I just totally ripped open all the days on accident. I just ripped open half the box. Hold on a second, y'all, hold on a second. Don't look at the rest of them. It's a surprise. Day six is vitamin C, night cream, and night is spelled wrong. Like, really wrong. By Jay Suing. And I cannot get it out of here to save my... Don't look at the rest. I'm not looking at the rest. I'm just looking. I'm just opening this enough to get this out. Get out. Vitamin C Nth cream brightening and anti-aging. Deeply moisturizes, improves fine lines, dull skin. Contains hyaluronic acid. All right. Expiration date is 3/14/26. Well, good. That's good to know. Okay, so much for Eel Ho. Sephora. Where's the cat calendar? Oh, I think I hid it somewhere because Loki kept trying to get in it. Or maybe it's down under there. Here go. Here comes Sephora. We look at how cute it is. I can't get over that. Oh, I can get over it. Five and six. Here's day five. It says take care of your skin. And it is Sephora Hyaluronic Acid All Day Hydrator Hydrate and Glow. Super Hydrant, 96% ingredients from nature, from natural origin. Okay. All right. Cool. That was five. And then six says, a line that changes your look.
That would be a lip liner. Wow, that is red. That's a very red lip liner. Ooh, like red, red, but pretty. Oh, sorry. I didn't realize I had my glasses on this whole time. The glare must have been annoying. Okay, so that's day six of Sephora. Yippee. Put this back in here very carefully. It's so floppy. Why? Why did I think I could put it in that way? Okay, there's Sephora. Gems. I don't even want to, like, the gems. Put Sephora down there. Day five of gems is right down here. Oh, this looks like, um... I want to say like Dalmatian Jasper or Snowflake Obsidian or Pretty. It is right there. Spotted Stone. Under the trade name Calcentin or Cori. The name, the source of this ingredient is the fossil remains of ammonite um the closer the color of zebra stone is to the ground the darker or more brown right i don't i don't know but it's a it's really awesome i like it in fact i have a little bowl that i'm putting them in okay six Cats are asleep on the end of my bed. Six is... We already got probably just clear quartz. White crystal. Transparent. And opaque. Okay. Yeah. All right. So there's that one. Nifty. That came from Timu too. Then Fab Fit Fun. And then there's, I see where I hid the cat calendar. Okay, let me get Fab Fit Fun. There's going to be a crash. Because I have all these stuff out. This Fat Fit Fun one is so big. There it goes. All right. Here we go with Fat Fit Fun. Day number five. I forgot we have no internet. Am I even going to be able to upload this? Oh, no. We got electricity, but no internet. Fat Fit Fun is Laura Geller. I love her stuff. It looks like an eyeshadow palette. Oh, it's a whole makeup palette. It's got, or is it all blushes? It's the Social Butterfly Face Palette with... Versatile hues. Looks like eyeshadows and then two full face palette. Party in a palette. The social butterfly. Cool. Oh, I have to cut it? No. Okay. Let 
Now I have to get it out. Just rip the box. Just rip the box. All right. It looks like this. It's got different beautiful colors of eyeshadow, beautiful blush. Well, the blush is kind of pale, but that's okay. And highlighter. Nice. I like the I like the colors of the eyeshadow. Oh, it even just says where to put it. Base, lid, crease, line, outer corner, inner corner. Wow, I could follow the directions. Awesome, I love. I love it when they spell it out for me like that. Otherwise, I'll just make a mess. Okay, that was five and then six is over here. Uh, this is my favorite one. I'm going to be bummed when this one is done. Okay, let me... It's just getting them open that's a pain in the neck here. Where are my scissors? Don't worry. I've got a toolkit. Okay, sorry. I'll be. I'll come out from behind this thing. It's so big. All right, I'm going to cut through this perforation. Bob the Builder, can we fix it? Yes, we can. Yay! I love Spongel. Peace. Mmm, it smells good. It's wonderful. So these are the, if you've never used these, you just get in the shower with this and it turns into a big, wonderful sponge. Although it came, this part came off. Oh, well. Oh, it broke. I can put it back together. I see. And that's fabulous. Wow, that's fantastic. Okay, it smells so good. Good. All right, now let me put this back together. What happened? It came open. And then last but certainly not least, we have the cat advent calendar. Thank you for hanging around if you're hanging around through my advent calendar journey. It's really not the way we were meant to be celebrating advent, but That's all right. All I want for Christmas is internet. Okay, close it. Lean back on the squishy pillow. Get it out of my life. Cat, cat. Put that right there. Okay, day five for the cats was right here. I'm just not good at poking through holes. Like the perforations don't help at all. Okay, this is a little tiny Christmas tree. I see Luna. I don't see a Loki. It's cute. Throw it over there. Okay, there's that. And then day number six is, it says Merry Christmas on the back. Aww. Oh my gosh, it's a little Santa with a little feather. I just worry about them swallowing and choking on these little bells though. But it says handmade. Well, that's a shame because my cats are going to eat it. They're really going to eat those feathers. What's this? What is it, Luna? Okay, that's a cute advent calendar for cats. All right, now we're at an hour and nine minutes, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love and appreciate you guys so much. And 
Thank you for hitting the thumbs up button if you feel so inclined. And if you made it to the end, thank you for sticking around. And I will actually be back tonight with a air cooker. What do you call that thing? An air fryer unboxing. Because that company is really mad at me if I don't do something with it. Unfortunately, I'm not going to eat. Here comes the wrecking ball. He came in like a wrecking ball. All right, before he comes over and knocks everything down, I'm going to say goodnight. And I'll see you in a few minutes. If you want to pop into my air fryer video, that would be awesome. If not, I totally understand. All right, how do we stop this thing?